Did you know that fish can be globetrotters too? Some prefer the cozy corners of lakes and rivers, while others love the vastness of the open sea. Let's dive in! Freshwater fish like catfish, trout, and sunfish call a myriad of places home. These range from crystal clear lakes and winding rivers to swampy wetlands and shallow ponds. Each of these habitats presents its own unique set of challenges and rewards. On the flip side, the salty squad, including albacore, tuna, and cod, inhabit the vast, diverse oceans. These range from warm, vibrant tropical seas to icy, desolate polar waters. Their habitats are just as varied, encompassing coral reefs, mangroves, seagrass beds, the deep sea, and even frigid Arctic and Antarctic regions. So whether it's a tiny pond or a massive ocean, fish have found a way to call it home. Fish are more than just pretty scales and fins. Their bodies are built to survive and thrive in their habitats. Let's take a peek inside. Freshwater fish, like your goldfish, have gills that function like a water purifier. They extract oxygen and keep impurities out. Their kidneys are like a bustling water factory, processing vast quantities of water. They also have a curious habit of drinking lots of water to balance out the salty snacks they sometimes eat. On the other hand, saltwater fish, like the mighty shark, have a bit of a different setup. They lose water through their gills due to osmosis. That's water moving from less salty to saltier environments. To replace the lost water, they drink seawater. But wait, isn't seawater salty? Yes, it is. That's where their super kidneys come into play, filtering out excess salt and making them salty sea sippers. From gills to kidneys, fish bodies are amazing survival machines. Fish are not just survivors, they're innovators too. They've developed some cool features to adapt to their environments, ready to be amazed. Let's start with freshwater fish. Catfish are known for their whisker-like feelers or barbells, which they use to sense food in murky water. Paddlefish, on the other hand, have long paddle-shaped snouts that they use to stir up bottom-dwelling organisms. And let's not forget about the sturgeon with their bony plates, or scutes, for armor. They're like tiny knights. Now let's dive into the sea and check out some saltwater fish. Swordfish have long, sword-like bills that they use to stun and spear prey. Anglerfish use bioluminescent lures that dangle like worms to attract prey. And let's talk about predators. They have diverse teeth placements for efficient hunting. You can find teeth in their throats, mouths, tongues, and even on the edges of their jaws. Whether it's sensing food or hunting prey, fish have some fantastic features to make life a little easier. Wow! Who knew fish were so fascinating? From their habitats to their bodies and cool features, they're truly amazing. We've uncovered a lot of interesting information today. Remember, every fish, big or small, salty or fresh, plays an important role in our world. They each contribute to the balance of our ecosystems, from the smallest pond to the widest ocean. So let's appreciate all fish for their unique adaptations and the vital roles they play. Thank you for joining me on this underwater adventure. I hope you've enjoyed learning about freshwater and saltwater fish as much as I have. If you're eager for more fishy fun and ocean adventures, don't forget to subscribe. Stay curious and keep exploring, because the world is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. Until next time, bye Curious Crew!